this. Well, if he can't understand it, I don't know what he said. Okay, it's gonna go like this. Good should be right. Oh my! What a patient little girl you I are. Know. Thanks. So these will go back like this. That's good. Oh, I think we did have it on right. We're going to find out, because he's going to be doing great. Turn for the girl. Okay. Hang on, sir. Okay. Okay, sweetheart. What a good girl you are. Okay. Then we're going to be sure. I know. Get the knee's clear. That's like the most important okay. thing for us. So the knees should go. So have, have to go all the way through the whole thing. Move it around like a right. The right one is more flexible. Right. The left one is more locked. So you okay. have to put the left one in first. Okay. Okay. All right, honey. Let me do this. Okay. Zena, you look so smart in that cart. I can't even okay. tell you. Okay. I don't want to hurt her in any way. Right. So what the other thing we'll have to do is normally it should be like this. Right? With right. the knees. Move this, this strap back so then the weight can go down through her, okay. her front legs. Otherwise, it's going to put too much strain up on her neck, which okay. we do not want. Right. I don't want. Yeah, okay. And that. then she either should be wearing So when you say harness, you mean like the standard, like a regular, like yeah, the like what this goes, is, but the basic one. Oh, but like, okay, that's why I just want to make sure it wasn't like a special harness. Or yeah. Anything. Okay. So hang on, Oliver. Okay. You stay here, right. Oliver. I'm gonna pick you up. Okay. Here you go. Let's go. Let's you stay go. here, Oliver. There you go. There you go. Okay. Don't you? Okay. Stay there, Oliver. We'll be right back. Come on, Tina. Come on. So what do you think in terms of, ma'am, I don't want to put too much stress on her neck, on her shoulders, but it's just a part where you know how much people talk. Yeah. Are you concerned about the stress on the neck and shoulders? I mean, it's... The way that this harness fits her is kind of wonky. Yeah. I mean, it's a...
Right, because the harness is so good. I mean, it's like, no, you can't do this because she will no, be I mean, crippled. This is like, no, this is like, uh, you know, 100% better than what she was. Okay. I know, it's kind of like, kind of pick your poison. Exactly, you know? anything, getting her in a horizontal position and linking down better than, than what she was doing. Okay. So, I think. And this I like because there's like, she has a lot of clearance here, yeah. you know, rather yeah. than all the other parts. Her yeah. hips are way back here. Right. So, this is this, oh, this one this from is, So if she were to get rubs or something or sores, doctor, where would they like show up on her, like where she's hitting right her up in here? Her axilla, her under her armpits would uh -huh. be uh, right over the points of her shoulders. Okay. Um, those would be probably the biggest areas to watch for. Come on, come on, come oh. on. exercising in it or something like that? Like what's yeah. the protocol? Exactly. Okay. Probably start with five to ten minutes, um, maybe like three or four times a day. Okay. Um, and then just watching you know, under the armpits, over the points of the shoulders, um, and then in here for sores. Okay. And not letting them, you know, fester. Right. <laughs> no, no, of course, yeah. I'm just cleaning it out. If I do see something, just like with uh, Okay. Do you have any chlorhexidine or anything? That? I don't, no. Okay. Yeah, so, so there's something like that. Yeah, some cleaning. Yeah, some or some kind of dilute cleaning solution. Um, clean them, dry them really well. Right. Keep her from 